A heartbreaking story out of Ontario tonight. Police believe three members of the same family succumbed to carbon monoxide poisoning. They'd brought a propane heater into their home after the furnace had stopped working. And as Christina Stevens reports, for some reason their carbon monoxide detector didn't wake them up. And by the time another family member arrived, it was too late. Tragedy unfolded early this morning in Brampton, Ontario, when a man came home to find his family overcome by carbon monoxide. Six-year-old Peter Padamber, his wife Sita, and 36-year-old son Terry passed away. Peter's brother Paul and a friend staying downstairs survived. The family had been running industrial strength propane heaters inside after their furnace broke down yesterday. When the sun came home, an alarm was going off, so they did have a carbon monoxide alarm. Fire officials say the CO detector was on the lower level away from the heaters. So by the time it went off, it was too late, leaving relatives grieving a stunning loss. They had the biggest hearts in the world. They'd do anything for anybody. The loss also hitting the West Indian community hard. Originally from Guyana, the family ran Calypso Hut, a popular restaurant and gathering place for nearly three decades. There was a similar tragedy just a few months ago. During the Ontario ice storm, a Newcastle man and his mother died after carbon monoxide seeped into their home from a gas generator running in the garage. I just don't want you going in the building right now. And there were several evacuations as a result of people bringing barbecues and heaters into their homes. Carbon monoxide is a silent killer. Unlike smoke, you can't smell it, taste it, or even see it. Nearly 40 Canadians die every year from carbon monoxide poisoning, but detectors in homes are only law in Yukon and Ontario. This Ontario MPP fought for legislation for five years and says location is critical. At least one detector on every floor. If it's going in the basement and you're sleeping upstairs and can't hear it, the carbon monoxide can make that trip, but if the sound can't make it back, you won't know it's going off. They have expiry dates, and based on that, should be replaced every five to ten years. And there are symptoms to watch for. You can get headaches, um, you can uh, feel dizziness, um, even nauseous. Meanwhile, relatives are in mourning. The family, very nice family, very friendly, very loving. He says he's getting more carbon monoxide detectors for his home, right away. Christina Stevens, Global News, Toronto.